Hello, everyone. This is Jeff Corhan. Hey, since launching my new podcast, This Old New Business, which you are looking at, I've come to learn that not everyone is familiar with podcasting or how to listen and subscribe to them. So that's what I'm going to show you in this quick video tutorial. Right now, you're at the preview of my podcast on iTunes. From this point, and this is where you would link to from my site and, and to other people, when they give you a link, it'll take you to this panel. And you can listen to their podcast by clicking on the buttons here to the respective episodes, but you can't subscribe. So you need to get within iTunes, go beyond the preview. And so you'll see up here, you've got the controls to uh, actually start the podcast from from clicking here first, and then you would have the granular controls up here. And obviously you can subscribe here. And then those of us like to have ratings and reviews because that helps us rank more highly within iTunes. And that happens here. You just click there to write a review. Now, let's say you just launch iTunes. It would take you to, well, let's, let's relaunch it from another screen. I guess it's going to take us here. You'll see this button within the iTunes store. So it's going to be advertising all kinds of stuff. And you go to the podcast button, click here, go to respective category and find the um, podcast that you want to listen to. Another way is to go up into the search box here and search for a particular podcast and it'll take you to that preview screen that I just showed you. So you have this new and noteworthy section here. That's where those of us are hoping to land in the initial weeks and why we want to get those positive five-star reviews and ratings. Further below, you can find what's hot. So these are the established podcasts, uh, some of which I listen to. So that's iTunes. Now, the downside of iTunes, once you subscribe, is that you are on the go and aren't going to be necessarily behind your computer. So you want to find an app to listen to on your mobile device. There is the iTunes podcast app, which everybody has if you've got a fairly recent iPhone. It's a little busy. It's a little challenging to figure out how the controls work and manage the subscriptions. So my recommendation is to try a couple of others. One, if you have an iPhone, is the Overcast app. It's got a very simple interface, very, very just easy to understand how the buttons work, how to turn various things off and on, subscribe to, let's say, three episodes at a time, that sort of thing. And that's great if you have an iPhone, but what if you have an Android? Well, there is the Stitcher app, which I do use, but let's first get clear about what is Stitcher. Stitcher is another platform, just like iTunes, that pulls the, those podcasts, that audio, from where those of us that create them host it. So you can listen within Stitcher online. Uh, there's my, there's the player. There's the most recent episode. Here's one further down that I previously uploaded. And then further down again is where you can leave a rating and review. But the biggest value I believe of Stitcher is their app. It's real easy to work with just like Overcast. And of course it does, as you can see here, work with the Android device. So I hope you get into podcasting. I think you'll find it's a great way to educate yourself and to listen some, to some good material other than, let's say, the music you've been listening to all the time and getting away from commercials and that sort of thing. There are hundreds of thousands of podcasts out there. And of course, I hope you do give mine a listen and try it out. Thanks for listening.